Hello everyone, this is Linda, and I'm here with a video response for uh, Christy's um, challenge giveaway number two, I think she's calling it, and uh, that would be Twins for Me Too here on YouTube, and I will link to um, the challenge below. Uh, first of all, I'll tell you what the rules were. Um, you have to be a subscriber. You must be at least 18 or have your parents' permission. Watch the tutorial, which Christy has made a tutorial, and I'll also link to that. Uh, create this little mini here. You can do one or more, and then upload a video or send pictures if you don't make videos. Um, leave a message on the giveaway challenge um, video telling her you have uploaded or emailed her a picture. So, okay, I think that was it. So I hope it didn't confuse you, but I will link both uh, the, the tutorial and the rules for the challenge. I'll link both videos below. So this is... Uh, the mini that I made, and um, I think it came out pretty cute. I used this um, Knitwit Collections by Mary Fran, and it's um, a Lily of the Valley uh, paper, and um, I really like this. I, I think it's really pretty. Not very Christmassy, but very pretty. So, anyway, that's what I used, and um, I used Wild Orchid Crafts flowers, and I stickled those. I used some trim here that uh, I think came from Hobby Lobby, and I have a doily in the back, which you really can't see very much of, um, a little bit of seam binding here. And um, this was a wood, ven just a little wood veneer, and I um, painted it white. I stamped friends on it, and I really can't remember what stamp it is because I made this a long time ago. And then I put glossy accents on it, and while the glossy accents was wet, I used some of this diamond dust, and I just sprinkled it on. So I like the way it turned out, and I've been saving it for something special and I just haven't really had anything to use it for and it just seemed like it went very well on this. So then um, I used I used some, I think it was, um, I can't remember if it's Old Olive or if it's um, Artichoke. Artichoke, maybe, the um, paper, but I know that it's um, Stampin' Up cardstock. So this is the inside, and it has a little pocket, and I put some trim along the edge there, and then I put some trim along here, and I used a um, magnet to close it. Then, I hope you're seeing this. I can't see my, if I'm in camera, in, in the range that I should be, but I'm, I'm hoping that you can see it. And then, this is... Uh, my little photo pages, front and back. So, and then I just used a piece of pink seam binding to tie a bow, which uh, is a little wrinkled, but it's okay. And then I used um, another uh, magnet to close it. So yeah, that's my little mini. And um, I actually did make two. So I'll show you the other one. I kind of put the stuff away, so I'll try to just remember what I used. I used an old um, Christmas paper line from a couple of years ago, and I think it was um, a Recollections brand, maybe. Um, anyway, I didn't do a lot to the front. I thought it was pretty without doing too much. So I put glossy accents on all the berries 
and I used uh, Wink of Stella on the birds. I don't know if that's showing up or not, but um, anyway. And I also, and then I used a gray card stock, and I don't know. that I just had that in my stash, so I'm not sure um, who made that. And this um, is just some of the paper that was in the in the pack, and I thought that was pretty with the Merry Christmas there. And then I used um, some little Velcro dots to close this one up, and I put a little rickrack trim here. And I didn't have a ribbon that I thought really matched, so I just took a piece of ivory seam binding, and I used um, a Stampin' Up marker and just put some little dots on it, and it kind of, I thought, kind of matched the flower there. And then used this paper here, and on the back is there. So, yeah, so this is uh, my little minis that I made for Christie's Challenge. And like I said, I'll link everything below. You have plenty of time to still get in on this challenge because it doesn't close, I think, until, um, I think it's December the, let me see. Oh, well, I can't find it now. I'll link it below. I think it's December the 31st, maybe. Um, so you'll have, anyway, you have time. If you can find the time, you have the time to do it. Anyway, thanks a lot for watching, and I'll talk to you later. Bye now.